Why are you so obsessed with this package? What are you trying to do? <coughs> Trash. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Merry Christmas. How do you like my Christmas theme? My Christmas look? My Christmas colors? <laughs> Giving so much just winter season. <laughs> I don't know if you've watched my last video, but it was definitely the hair transformation for this look. Oh my God, I'm still wearing an AirPod. <laughs> so if you want to know how I get these scars, then watch my last video, but I think I watched it like one time since then. I really like it. Anyway, back by popular demand is me trying TikTok candy. candy. And for this video, I picked very <laughs> weird ones. But you know, that's just what you do for Christmas. You eat pickle taffies, but more on that later. Before we get into this video, I bet you already skip when you hear the sentence. Let a girl plug her own stuff, okay? You can still get my perfume, maybe as a Christmas present? Because I think it actually is a perfect Christmas present because it's not too expensive. It's just $19.99. And also it is the perfect like wintry sexy smell. I think it's perfect for winter. You know, if you want to like gift your loved one or your daughter or your son or your pet, 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 pet. a new a perfume. New perfume. Try it. Tabu by Naomi John. Baby can you feel the dark? Tabu. <gasps> Maybe I can gift it to my grandma. Don't watch this grandma. Okay, let's get into some sweets. Actually, I got all of this stuff from the shop Mexican Candy Lady. That shop is actually really cool because they have a lot of like TikTok candy. Very interesting candy in general, which I have never seen before. Shout out to the Mexican, the Mexican candy, candy Lady, lady. <laughs> whoever you are. Actually, you can only ship it to the United States, but you know, that's not gonna stop me anymore. <laughs> Nothing, Nothing can, can stop, stop me anymore. anymore. First of all, well, I ordered some Pringles, but not for this video. Maybe you already know what's coming. By the way, have Pringles always been this small? No, no, no. So the first thing I ordered are these spam chips. Never heard of these before. And if you know what spam is, it's basically very processed, very salty meat that doesn't really look like meat anymore. And my issue with spam is that I actually really like the taste of it, but I know how bad it is. So I don't really eat it a lot, but when I eat it, I really enjoy it. And I hate that. And it's kind of my guilty pleasure. So this small little package cost me $10. I think it's just that expensive because it's not local. Where it comes from, I don't know where exactly. I can't read it. Maybe I can. I'm learning Japanese on Duolingo. <laughs> oh, I know the last three hiragana. Iki soup. Work it. Actually, it has like a little price tag where it says $5. I don't know why it's 10 now. <laughs> but I guess Mexican candy lady has to make her coin somehow. It smells pretty much like spam. It actually is like a little bit pink. I don't know if you can see that, but it has like pink powder on it. Is that the pink spam on there? Mm. Mm. It tastes very much like spam. Oh, it's so salty. Mm. But it really is not a lot. <laughs> I found a really pink one. Mm. Oh my God, it looks like my skin color. Skin color spam. Ooh, that one was a little bit too intense. They really nailed the taste of Spam. I gotta shop. Next, I got this. And I think this looks so good. I don't know what it is, but it's giving me coolness. <laughs> it is Gushers Enchilados. I don't know what gu Gushers are. Gushers? The Americans are probably laughing at me. Fruit Gushers. Fruit Gushers? It looks like it's actually from the same bread that also makes fruit roll-ups. So it's basically Gushers, but covered in chamoy sauce, spices, like chili and stuff like that. So it's gonna be like tangy, sour. Ooh, but it looks really good and very vibrant. Oh. It's hard. I thought it was gonna be soft. And in order to actually eat the exact same snack that I saw in the TikTok, we have to cover it with zombie powder, which sounds dangerous. I have to say it doesn't actually look as vibrant as in the video or even on the website. It looks like a bit more toned down green. It actually doesn't really say what kind of flavor it is. It just says zombie and it says imported from Mexico, spice up your favorite foods like popcorn chips and the new trend pickles. But we're first going to try them by itself. Mm. <laughs> really sour and spicy. Oh, there's this 
a lot of chili on there. Maybe don't eat like five at once. Oh, this is so much flavor to process. Sour, tangy, spicy, sweet, and chewy. And good. Explains everything you need to know. I like it. It was just a bit too much at once. But now let's actually try it with the zombie powder and see if it changes something. Oh shit, it smells super spicy. Yes. Now it kind of looks like in the video. There is so much happening. I don't really know what the powder tastes like. I feel like it was more spicy, but I didn't like have a specific flavor. I just need like a little shot on my hand, a little tequila salt situation. Mmm, it's like kind of like salsa y, like salsa verde. It's very flavorful. <clears throat> now it's getting a bit spicy now that I ate my whole hand. I want to try something that I didn't think of. Wow, that was fast. What does it smell like in here? Spam. Oh yeah, you should try this. Do you know what this is? Sure. Once you've told me. It's gushers, but enchilada gushers. Is it gushers? Um, That's kind of like a salsa powder, I would say. It's really good, actually. Naomi approved. Yeah, it kind of smells like salsa verde. That's what it tastes like. Here's a little gushy. Oh. 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 <laughs> yeah, that was my reaction. Oh, you're not good? sure? I think it's good. It's just so intense that you really have to get ready for it. I just wish the gushers weren't gushers. But what What else? Nimm zwei? Uh, I like that it kind of like plops in your mouth. Did oh. it plop for you? I don't know which ones plop. Not all of them plop. Oh, no plop. Just a flop. Okay. This one's gonna plop. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but what are the dark ones? Apple flavor. Suck it in. <laughs> you won't like it. It's giving anticipated. <laughs> I want the super dark one. No, these are super dark ones. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. What is that? Oh, grape. Oh, grape. So you don't love it, but you're like, oh, okay. Can be eaten. Do you want to try this by itself? Do you know what it huh? tastes like? <gasps> Naomi, drugs! Meow. Grooming yourself. I'm not a groomer. I'm just kind a loser. Kind of giving <laughs> Thanks, that was Mexican Kenya lady. <laughs> Shout out to her. Does she have more? Do you want to try more? Do you have more? I have a whole box. From full. Mexican Kenya lady? Yes. <laughs> that was the spam chips. <laughs> <laughs> so for this next one, we're finally, for the first time in my life, and I can't believe the first time is right now, we're going to try pop and cooking, which is these miniature food kind of stuff that always have different kind of themes you can make donuts you can make burgers and we're actually gonna make mini ramen i just don't know how i haven't tried this yet because it looks like something that i would be obsessed with and i've been knowing it for so long i just never got the chance to try it for some reason so now i finally get pop and cooking ramen maybe it's savory maybe it's gonna taste like ramen just like a mini version let's do this ignore my very dirty table <laughs> it's been through a couple of years of using it for my videos and that is usually very rough this is everything it comes with i think you're supposed to cut all of this this is already so confusing. Add water to the cup until it's half full. We're gonna add mango pudding. Oh, so it's probably gonna be sweet. Now we gotta mix this. And the instructions say it will turn hard in 10 minutes. Now we gotta pour water in here. <gasps> no, my instructions! This is our dough powder. You go in there. Whoa, it's a lot. Oh, this is already pissing me off. <laughs> oh no, there's mango in there. Tear off two pieces of the dough and fill the Naruto egg molds. That is tiny. I have now put it in here. Okay, I need to take my sleeves off. The shit is getting serious. Calm down. Everything is okay. One, two, three, four. Oh, I gotta fold this. <gasps> I forgot to cut this. This is our form for the gyoza. My gyoza dough is trash. I can't even make this kind of dough, which isn't even dough. What the fuck? Dough is just always gonna be my nemesis. Oh, there's already a hole in it. Anyway. Oh, cute. Oh, bless. And now we are doing this. <gasps> oh, oh my God, look at my gyoza. Wowies. <clears throat> it's really bad. Oh, that one's even worse. The other one, we're just gonna make wraps. I think this is our ramen tray. Here comes the water. Oh, this is our soup. I feel like this might taste like Coke. This is our noodle powder. It's supposed to be that liquid. And now we're gonna put the noodle stuff in there. I need three hands for this. <sighs> Twist the top and then we can put noodles in here. <laughs> 
cute. That looks like ramen, am I right? I put some of it into the egg. It's maybe a little bit much egg yolk, but it's just a very blessed egg. Okay, I really have to assemble. I have to get all of my decorating skills here. This apparently is like a flan. Doesn't want to get out. Get out. Right now. It's the end of you and me. You're supposed to just flip it over and then it comes out. I feel like... Ah, I think now it's coming. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, Vincent, dinner is served. Oh, poopy, poopy, poopy. <laughs> is this ramen? Yeah. When bananas! No, gyoza saba. I oh. guess. <laughs> I'm glad that you brought me for this. Let's try a gyoza. Mm. Mm. It's so watery inside. Why did it become a liquid? <clears throat> but it's kind of good. It actually tastes mm. like dough. Like the texture. Yeah. <laughs> Wowie. That is not a spring roll, just call it something else. Rap. Rap futuristico. Oh. Rap futuristico. Oh. Is it just the same? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> That's Coke flavored Haribos. Ooh. Bah. The noodles itself taste like nothing. Let's have some of the rich broth. That's just the Coke flavor. Uh. Do you want to have the best part, the egg? <laughs> oh no, what happened to it? That's just how my egg looks. Nice. The flat flan. The flan. It's mango. So lovely. I guess the fun is in the making it process. Which I'm glad you had all the fun. I didn't. <laughs> Thanks. I mean, you can thank me for providing us with dinner tonight. <laughs> but I mean, I somehow knew that it wouldn't be the most fun for me to make these. Maybe that's also why I never did it. Deep down in my heart, I knew that I do not have the patience for this. But I also kind of wish that they would actually taste savory, like actual ramen. It's not satisfying that it's sweet, in my personal humble opinion. So whatever. I did that and nobody can ever tell me to make pop and cook. Next, I want to try something that actually looks really good again and it is these type of oreos that i have never ever in my life seen before i didn't know stuff like this exists it's actually called cloud oreo so it's probably, probably very, very soft <laughs> i have it right here it's open doesn't matter because the oreos are individually packed packed <laughs> it looks like my kind of aesthetics pink there's the date november 5th 2022 on there i hope that's not the expiration date but it says fufu Ooh, it smells good it doesn't really look very aesthetical anymore <laughs> nah. it's somehow tastes good but also disgusting at the same time it tastes so much like bubble gum with super artificial strawberry flavor and it's also kind of sour and i hope it's supposed to be like that it is very soft though very cloudy indeed also the aftertaste is giving cleaning product glass cleaner detergent it's not really my thing i do like the consistency though i guess the cloud oreos not for me. So for this next one, you probably have seen chamoy pickles on TikTok. So basically like bright red, huge pickles. I found a pickle like this. It looks dangerous. <laughs> the salties chamoy pickle. So I guess we're kind of gonna get a similar flavor as with the gushers, but it's also gonna have a pickle flavor in it because it's a pickle. I just hope it doesn't taste like American pickles because American pickles are trash. Sorry, Americans, but you can't do pickles. I think I gotta take these off for that. We basically can't see the pickle because it is pickled in this kind of chamoy sauce. That's doch demonetarisiert. Nee. Disgusting. It's so gross and spicy. Gross and spicy. I think this is the worst pickle I've ever tried in my whole life. And it's also spicy. Maybe if I add a little bit of the zombie powder. I don't know. <gasps> I am so stupid. <laughs> okay, this is what it looks like now. I'm just hoping that this will make it a bit better. <laughs> no, not this. Not this. It didn't do anything. Get back in there. I have one last thing that I want to try. I'm not sure if this will be much better than what I just tried, but we're gonna try pickle 
taffies. Taffy taffies. Pickle flavor. I actually never had a taffy, just a freeze-dried one, but never like this. I don't know how they get the pickle flavor in there, but it's probably also gonna be American pickle flavor. <sighs> and I've just had it. Here it is. It's green and also red. I don't know why it's red. Wow, it's so hot. <laughs> I didn't want to eat the whole thing. Oh my God, you're always this hot? Oh my God, that's gonna rip my teeth out. It's kind of good. It also kind of tastes like an American pickle, but it works. It's not too bad. Is it also a bit spicy or is my mouth still spicy from everything else? I don't mind this. I'm so sorry for the eating noises. Oh, uh -huh. eating it is not that good. Sucking it is better. I don't think this will be my favorite candy though, but it's definitely one of the best candies out of this video. I mean, the best one was no doubt the spam chips. I also like the enchilada gushers. Everything else is kind of trash. Sorry, Mexican candy like I don't think it's your fault. I think it's the fault of the people that make these candies and pickles. I'm gonna have to soak up this chamoy pickle puddle that is on my table. It's just staring at me. That wasn't my most successful candy slash food video. But you can't always be lucky, right? I feel like my last videos were all kind of good and I also kind of signed up for failure. I mean, actually just with the pickle candy and that was kind of good. But you know, I just got lots of lessons and learnings that I can take from this video. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social media, which is Naomi John on Instagram. Naomi John on TikTok. And the Naomi John on I'm gonna clean up this mess now <laughs> and uh, Merry Christmas, hey! Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Blah. I think I'm gonna throw up. I hate my fucking life. <laughs>